Hey people, if you own yourself a late model Ford Ranger or a Ford Everest or the Mazda BT50, um, you may want to get the tool out of the boot and see if it can actually remove the factory wheel nuts because most likely they look like this. And if you try to remove them, they may end up looking like this. Now I've got a set of new wheel nuts here and I'm going to go about replacing the factory wheel nuts. Now in order to actually get this wheel nut off, I actually have to hammer the socket onto the wheel nut because the shape has been deformed so much already. I'm using an impact here to get it off, but uh, you can just use a standard ratchet if you need to. Now you can see that this wheel nut is actually now stuck into the socket, and I need to use a fair bit of force to actually get the socket um, off that wheel nut. These wheel nuts have only been removed a few times, and already you can see the um, deformation in that outer ca casing of the wheel nut. Now the ones that I'm replacing are with they're the exact same size, they're a perfect fit for the factory tool, um, they're a chrome finish, but these ones are made completely of steel and they won't deform like those factory ones. Now I'm just replacing one at a time here. Uh, once we um, put the wheel nut in, we now just torque it up. Now it gets torqued to 135 newton meters of torque. Now if you don't have yourself a torque wrench, well we just do them up nice and firm. I'm just going through here one by one replacing these wheel nuts and then doing them back up again. Now I also do suggest that once you've done them all up that you take the car for a bit of a drive and then maybe you just check the torque on those again. Because they are new wheel nuts um, sometimes they take a little bit just to settle in against the rim. So again just torquing this up to 135 newton meters of torque. Now once all those wheel nuts have been taken off it's uh, time to write myself here a letter. So I'm saying here, hey Ford, these wheel nuts are junk. Make sure you throw them at the clown who thought it was a great idea to put them on my car. So I'm just going to drop these in a box and send these off to Ford and I'll let you know if they ever get back to me. I doubt they will. Hey now, thanks for watching. Make sure you check out some of my other videos and be sure to subscribe and give it the thumbs up.